In the summer of 1518, the streets of Strasbourg, a city in what is now France, were witness to one of the most bizarre events in history. It all began with a single woman, Frau Trophy, stepping out of her house and starting to dance fervently in the streets. What started as an odd spectacle soon escalated into a full-blown epidemic of dancing. Day after day, Frau Trophy danced relentlessly, and what was initially seen as an isolated incident soon spread like wildfire. Within a week, dozens of other people had joined her, and within a month, hundreds were caught up in the compulsive dance, unable to stop themselves. The afflicted dancers exhibited symptoms of a trance-like state, unable to control their movements or cease dancing even as their bodies weakened from exhaustion. Some danced until they collapsed from sheer fatigue, while others succumbed to heart attacks, strokes, or dehydration. It was a scene of chaos and confusion as the streets of Strasbourg became a surreal dance floor of suffering. Authorities and medical professionals were perplexed by the epidemic. Various theories were proposed to explain the phenomenon, ranging from supernatural curses to astrological alignments. Some believed it was a punishment from God, while others attributed it to demonic possession. In an attempt to alleviate the suffering, local officials even arranged for musicians to accompany the dancers, hoping that the music would somehow cure them. As the weeks passed, the situation grew increasingly dire. Concerned about the impact on public order and health, authorities sought solutions to halt the epidemic. Finally, it was decided to transport the afflicted dancers to a shrine dedicated to Saint. Vitus, the patron saint of dancers, in the hopes of seeking divine intervention. Eventually, the epidemic began to wane, and by the end of September, the dancing plague had subsided. The exact cause of the phenomenon remains a mystery to this day, with scholars speculating about possible explanations such as mass hysteria, ergot poisoning, or psychological contagion. The Dancing Plague of 1518 stands as a testament to the strange and unpredictable nature of human behavior, reminding us that history is filled with events that defy easy explanation. It remains a fascinating and enigmatic chapter in the annals of history, capturing the imagination of scholars and storytellers alike for centuries to come.